From travelers to shoppers, they're out this weekend getting those last minute gifts. And here's a look at how it looked at Glendale Galleria. With only six days until Christmas, shoppers know they have to act quickly to get those gifts for their loved ones this holiday season. This is super crowded. Were you surprised to see this crowded? Yeah. I, I was not expecting it. It's been stressful, yeah. It's a lot of rush in there. So just difficult. A lot of people. But a year and 10 months into the pandemic, many people are ready to get their holiday traditions and lives back to normal. So retail experts say if you plan on relying on shipping services to get there by Christmas, you may want to consider another option. Weather could cause possible delays. I spoke with Kristen McGrath from The Real Deal Shopping Blog. So as we know, the countdown is on less than a week to go before Christmas actually comes. And a lot of people have been letting us know that they're worried that their gifts are not going to come on time because their delivery dates keep getting pushed back. What advice do you have for these shoppers and, and what should they know? Right, so um, it is a frustrating year for shoppers and retailers um, and fulfillment services alike. And it is very common right now that people are getting the word that their package is getting pushed back, even if they did order by a retailer's deadline, even if they ordered early. Uh, so my advice would be, I think everyone's gonna have to be a little more flexible this year, including recipients of gifts. So, you know, if it's something really special that you got someone, maybe find a way to print out acknowledgement of the gift, tell them what they're getting, um, and, and, you know, tell them that it didn't arrive on time, like so many gifts this year. Um, it's also an option to get them something that might go nicely uh, with their gift. Um, like, for example, you know, if you ordered someone um, a nice blanket and some loungewear, maybe get them a little coffee cup and a little printout of what you got them to make it a little more special. Any tips for people who still need to finish this Christmas shopping? Because, you know, a lot of the, the retail stores, they're staying open a little bit later. But should people go to those retail stores or should they take a chance and shop online? So right now, if you're relying on shipping, things are really risky. A few retailers have their um, shipping deadlines coming up uh, in the next couple of days. But even if you order now, there's always the chance that a weather delay or a delivery delay will happen. Um, so what I would say is if you don't want to go in stores, you still have plenty of options. Um, you can get a digital gift that doesn't rely on shipping. Um, maybe subscribe someone to Home Chef or a streaming service or or Rosetta Stone or Masterclass, anything that's special that shows you've thought of them, but that doesn't rely on shipping and can be delivered to them instantaneously. You also have the option of buying online and picking up in store as soon as the same day. Not everything you want might be available, but it's a way to complete your checkout process online, go to the store and get things loaded in your car the same day so you can take them home and wrap them. All right, some great tips and experts also suggest buying what they call one size fits all gifts. These are gifts that can be bought for several people all at once so you can take time shopping for individualized gifts. All right.